Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. Today we're going to see how to connect your MSV Status 3 with Android. You can see that we have the MSFET app right now. The MSFET app took an update and now it's called Zap. So in case you need to download this app, search by Zap, not MSFET. You can see the third page we have my device, press watch and with QR code, watch with QR code, it will open up the QR code reader, scan the QR code and this should be connected in a couple of seconds. You can see the MSFET is starting. And now the MSFET Status 3 is started. You can use it without any problem. And this is what all it takes to power it on or connect it just a few steps to connect this watch of is very simple and very useful so now we are able to use the app like we should let's get back to the first page and see what we got as we can see in the first page we have the steps at the top burn calorie statistic for day week month as well and we have the sleep for day, week, month or year statistic. You can see average, deep sleep, light sleep, awake time, fall, sleep time, etc. After the sleep, we have statistic for heart rate and all the history of the heart rate measurements will be here. Also, we have the history for sports as well. And we have the streaks at the bottom of the page. And the second page we have here other options and we have the tools that we can access faster in the second page we have alarm plug that we can set from the app and which will ring in the watch we have find device and we have friends after that we will find here target settings you can see the find device works pretty good it vibrates actually a lot and it powers on the watch so you can hear and find it after that as we said we have friends my goals you can see we have set goals for steps weight calories and sleep as well so we have four options for the goals we have wash face store this is a very good way to change your wash faces in the stratus 3 and any ms fit it's very easy and fast way to do it which is always a good thing you can see just press it in a couple of seconds it will change it so it's a very good and very easy way to use it so this was the option to change it you can also take a picture or select from gallery and set it as your face and your watch we have notification settings, you can see we have the notifications for apps, call alert, SMS, etc. Also you can select the apps that you want to alert you and the apps that you don't want to hear from them. We have also the music controller and the notifications for the music app. At the sports, as you can see we have real time sports data settings, you can change the order of them and in the third page you can see we have our profile and we have the profile of Stratus 3 you can see the settings for this watch we have connection and we have the battery percentage and we have a couple of options that repeat itself I will say I hope uh, MSFET fixes this because we saw the widget manager before we saw the faces and the friends uh, connecting port so MSFET really does repeat all a couple of their options you can see again the notification that we saw right before coming in the third page we have here the ram updates and etc here in more we have customer satisfaction we have my goals again my records which we saw before we have friends again 
add account that you can connect with WeChat or other things. We have smart analyze settings. We have here's units and the settings that we can change. Show status and notification shade. Check for updates and about the watch at the bottom we have sign out. This is the software of the MSFIT. Let's see how the notification will work. So the notification worked pretty good and guys this was all for today's video. I hope you find this video interesting and helpful. If so hit the like button, subscribe to our channel and we will see you in the next video with another smartwatch.